Hello again all and welcome back to uh, Let's Play Golden Sun. Let's just lower the volume again. Seem to be uh, pretty good at starting off with too high volume. And uh, in this episode we're going to complete the Vault Cave. He says. I hope I do. 15 minutes is a long time. Ah, this room. My most hated of all rooms. I despise this room. Now what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to go round the edge and all the way around again. But I try and just go for it in a straight line. Just time it right and you can do it in a straight line. Uh, so I will meet you after I have managed to finish this puzzle. Alright, we beat the puzzle. What you want to do is you want to push it up one square from the beginning. And then wait. And then after that second drip in the straight line, as soon as you see that fall, move. And you will be able to do it in a straight line, no problem. And, oh, I've just gone in a big loop. Great, but I've opened the gate now, which is the most important thing. Because we need that gate open. And another random battle, and another new enemy. I could have shown off the death caps before, but I didn't. Because uh, I was very frustrated after the Lamacan Desert, as you can imagine. The place is exceedingly annoying. But the Ravager is, can do some damage, but nothing too threatening. Nothing that I really am worried about, to be honest. Pretty simple to kill. Uh, especially if you put your whole group on it, it'll probably die very quickly indeed. And you'll notice that we can't do anything. Why can we not do anything? Do I need to use reveal? No. Damn. Damn. I've gone the wrong way. <sighs> I'm always doing this. I swear. No. This way. No, it's this is the right way. Getting lost on a game that you've played through four or five times is never good. Ah, that's the exit I wanted to go to. There we are. Uh, nothing I care about. Ugh. Can we please run? Please? Thank you. I will end up doing more level grinding off screen, but I don't want to do that on screen. And uh, the enemies we're fighting right now were stronger than them, and we're stronger than we should be anyway. So I don't really need to fight them right now. Uh, but eventually, uh, when I get to a later stage, uh, when I reach a later area, I will be doing quite a bit of level grinding, getting five or six levels at least uh, before going on. Uh, yeah, this is the quicker way, and uh, you'll notice that that's been filled with water now. Uh, so we have to go around the other way. And uh, what am I doing? Right. Oh, oh. Leave me alone. Okay, in that last fight we learned Icehorn, uh, level 17 cleric for Maya now. Definitely a good thing to uh, have. And now we can go down. Can we go through here? Yes, we can. Awesome. Damn it. Yeah. Success. More healing. Thank you. And that should be the end of Vault Cave. Yes, it is. Now, if you didn't hit the bell, you couldn't reach this DJ in, but because we have, we get a DJ in. And a good one at that. Sap is one of my favourite DJ in on this game. He heals you and attacks at the same time. Which is awesome. Like the mystery blade, the sword that we will be getting later on. But that's a light blade, so that'll be going on Ivan. If we get it from the lucky medals. Which I hope we do, because it's a pretty good sword. Life Nourish is the name of its unleash. For all of you anoraks out there. And this fight again. Yeah, they definitely need to get some variety with the fights in this cave. There's like three different fights. There's the Troll and the Gargoyle, the Deathcap and the Ravager, maybe them on their own, and the Fighter Beam. That's pretty much it. Nothing else as far as... Uh, I can't remember. There might be something else, but we haven't seen it. So. And there you go. Fighter B and Deathcap. Nothing. And now we're going to fight this Mimic. I couldn't be bothered before, but might as well now that we've got our extra DJ. 
And we're not even going to bother with DJ, we're just going to wail on him. He should die pretty soon. Well, a few turns, maybe. This I don't think this one even uses Impair like the one in uh, the Fushin Temple. It might do. Oh, it does, it uses Debilitate, not Impair. Yeah, Frostbite can uh, actually kill in one hit. It's like an instant death move possibility. Uh, nothing that's really that good. There you go. Easy as like easy as you like. And that's the end of Vault Cave. Now we will make our way to well, might as well go to Billibin Cave now and uh, show off what was uh, beyond that flame there. So I will see you there. Okay, we're now at the entrance to uh, Billabin Cave. Uh, now, I'm not entirely sure that you can use Reveal there. It looks like you can. So I'm going to check that in a minute. But I know that I can do something uh, in the other direction. So I'm going to check that first. Because I don't want to go over there and uh, use Reveal. And then find out there's nothing there. That would be uh, very silly. Uh, not that way. This way. If we wouldn't keep getting random fights, but let's just see how much stronger we've become. Oh wow, we still don't even kill it in one hit. Yeah, that's dead. <laughs> so is that. Nice. Yeah, if that. If the big troll in the other cave or whatever it was called uh, uses that move, that charge move, uh, it can do some damage. So I do want to find out what's over there, because I've never actually checked, surprisingly. Uh, I realised I've never actually checked, so uh, yeah, let's definitely find out. Yeah, I've never seen this before, so this is as interesting for me as it is for all of you. Which is a really strange thing, because I'm usually pretty accurate with those things. Yeah, but I do want to find out which way I have to go to get there. Um, I, don't, I, I don't know. It's not this way, is it? Don't remember anything this way. No, it's not. Interesting. I shall have to figure out this puzzle. Uh, yeah. I will have to figure out this puzzle and I will. Well, I suppose you can laugh at me as I fail if you want to. Yeah, we'll go with that. You can laugh at me as I fail. Uh, but that actually looks like you're supposed to jump from the south. Uh, let's go and use reveal uh, on that thing. Maybe that does what I want. Uh, let's just make sure leaving that doesn't actually get rid of the flame. No, it doesn't. Right, okay. Huh. I could find something new. I've never actually done this before. This is really exciting. Nothing this way. Oh, you can't trust anything right now. No, nothing there. Okay. Oh, I suppose I could have used reveal from the base, but I don't think it will reach. Let's just find out. Is there a reveal spot there? Dude, can we run? Thank you. We're wasting time here, but this is exciting. Uh, reveal. Ah, oh, looks like there is a door there. Let's go and check. Okay, I'll go and get up on that ledge and I'll see you in a sec. Okay, we're on the ledge, so let's see if there is anything. It looks like there is, it really does. Yeah, there is, alright. Uh, let's use douse on that. I've never been through here, this is exciting. I can't believe I've never remembered this, to go back and check this. I've never actually checked this. Yeah, it is, you run from the south. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Well, and there's two treasure chests. A side crystal. And a water of life. Alright, okay. So it's only 4,000 coins. Nothing too important. I was uh, excited there. Nothing else to uh, see here. No. 
Okay, well, I will meet you back at Calais. So, see you in a moment. Well, we're back at Calais. Uh, now, we can't go to Lumpert just yet. So, uh, don't even bother trying. Uh, we really just can't do anything there. The story won't allow us to. And uh, if you come here, you'll find we can do nothing. So, what we want to do, in fact, is to, uh, well, run down here and you see a dock there we want to go to those now in these docks you will find oh well first yeah we saw the ocean before we've seen rivers and stuff that is not the ocean An ocean and a sea, technically they're very similar, but one is landlocked and one isn't. Well, I suppose it's almost a lake if it's completely surrounded, but there you see a Venus Legion. But we can't get that just yet. We'll be getting that later. Not too much later, but later nonetheless. Now, there are supposed to be lots of tourists on the ship. We're going to check tickets until the tour. Well, can we go on this tour of the ship? Will we be able to reach a new land? Find out next time on Let's Play Golden Sun. This is uh, JOG, Jordan of Gaia, signing off. Have a good day. Oh, that was so cheap. Okay, bye-bye.